Case and this is going to be for a whole month's worth of a trip to Europe and it's, I'm going to be in Sweden and London if you guys were curious about that but that is my suitcase and I'm going to show you guys what I have in it this includes basically everything except for my tripod and I'll tell you guys all the stuff when we walk over there so I hope that you guys enjoy and let's just get started Okay, you guys, so this is my suitcase, and I do have duct tape, if you guys can see that. I have duct tape down there, just so I can identify my suitcase when it's going through the conveyor belt for baggage claim. And it's an American Tourister, and it's from Walmart, and I got, I got it in five Let's just get into, like, this bag. So, in this top part of my bag, in the big pocket, I have two packages of goodie um these are actually hair ties if you guys are wondering and they were they both have 70 in them this one's all black this one is um multicolored. this one i have a purse and this is just like gonna be the purse i'm gonna be using for a while while i'm there because i usually end up purchasing a purse there and this was just from claire's and it's just a cross body bag that is has no pockets on the inside so it was pretty it's pretty easy because all you do is throw all your junk in it. These are my underwear. So I have my underwear right here in this area. Socks and tank tops. Um, and then I have sports bras and then regular bras. And I just love that because it's such an easy way to be able to have my undergarment stored. We have a plastic bag for it. But this year, I have a different type of suitcase, so it works out a little bit better. Okay, you guys, so this is my actual suitcase. So I have my bigger jacket here because in Sweden it does get a little cold, and I don't want to be the girl freezing my butt off, but that's just covering it. And then I usually have, I'm going to have my tripod on top of everything, so it'll be like super easy to just grab um, because if I need to get to it when I get there. And here I have my makeup bag, which you guys, I'll link the video down below of that. And I have razors. I have 18 of them, and they're just like the cheap brand because I, you know, I don't need the expensive kind with me. And then I have a cover-up, a swimsuit cover-up, and then here is just a cover-up for a tank top, and then a cardigan. And then under that, I have my swimsuit and we're and some workout stuff, some workout shirts. And then on over here, I have we're on my tank tops, skirts. PJs and a couple other things under that and then over there I have my workout shorts and I have workout shorts under here too that are the spandex kind and then over there I have a, a, like all my tops I have like a couple long sleeves and everything like that and then under here I have my Naked Bee moisturizer sunscreen and I have my two other makeup bags then I have some swim, swim shoes my wedges are under there, which I hopefully will do a spring lookbook so you guys will see my wedges, which I'm not showing you guys yet. And then I have my swimsuit shoes and then my makeup brushes. So that's basically what I'm taking with me. Um, as you guys can tell, I'm a pretty light packer, but my carry-on is going to be a lot more full. So if you guys want to see my carry-on video, definitely check that out. And um, I will be sure to link that down below once it's uploaded. And then I also forgot to let mention that I do have my makeup remover wipes. I have my makeup remover wipes and I have this Kirkland one that's this big and then the travel size. And then I also have my book that I picked up, The Empty Glass, and it's going to be a really good book to read. So if you guys want to see what's in my favorites video for while I'm traveling, definitely like this video and comment down below if you guys want a favorites video because I'd love to show you guys my favorites while I'm there. So I hope that you guys enjoy, and I love you guys so, so, so much. That's just what's in my suitcase, and if you guys want to link yours down below, let me know. I love you guys so, so much, and I hope that you guys have a fabulous rest of your summer, and keep looking for my uploads. Some will be pre-filmed, some will not, so, yeah. So that is the suitcase, and that's what it looks like standing up. About 40 pounds, it's actually 38 pounds, but once I put my tripod in there, and I just like weigh it again. It's probably going to be 40 pounds. So I hope that you guys enjoyed and I love you guys so much. Bye.